punched it in chip a single tooth? Nah. <laughs> What's up, a bite my, I'm okay. chewing coconuts in my free time. Like, bro, what? That's gotta be the most paused shit I've ever heard in Baki. But then you just look at this man pickle, and he looks excited as fuck. The narrator was trying to say they're drawn together by primal instinct. Nah, bro, they're just zesty. Yo, Unc, I'm still good to fight tomorrow? You wanna fight pickle tomorrow? Uh... <laughs> Might want to train your booty. I think Pickle likes nah. boots now. Like that is not nah. <laughs> Might want to train your booty. I think Pickles likes cheeks. <laughs> Pickle want to play with your booty. The worst all whoopings in Baki. Pickle edition. Yeah. Dang. Okay, just dang. You right back. All right. You just... These particular guys right here quick. are straight dumbasses. Muffka must have been smoking straight crack if he thought he was right. gonna beat this digger nigga. This dude is literally older than Jesus Christ. Like, he was so OP, he had Earth game devs stressing trying to find a way to nerf this man. Yeah, I'm sure we uh, we might have a problem. Oh, mm. uh, why? What's going on? Yeah, you know that human class you made? Yeah, one of them is fucking hacking. What the f? Drop a meteor on that nigga. Bro said he's hacking. Nah, bro. Pickles or some other stuff, bro. I remember watching this on my way to DreamCon, bro. Nah, it was insane. There would have been a Bible chapter about how this nigga crossed up Jesus in a one-on-one. And his dumbass is like, oh my god, I must fight him and prove my honor. My honor. folded and got his leg punched on by George of the fucking jungle. Nah, George of the jungle is wild. Ooga, ooga, Bro, this season, Pickle turned this man Retsu Kaio into a D1 glazer. Man was so obsessed with Pickle. He went mental. Thorfinn is not. Thorfinn is a different breed, chat. But ask a lot, though. A bunch of other bigger buff niggas. Like, this is the zestiest shit. Ask him that went crazy. Put his dick up against this yo. random man's butt just to sneak in and see hey, yo. Him. That wasn't even the glazing that led to his ass whooping. Nah. Hey, yo. Thanks for the roast, man. I appreciate it. To death, this man took the glazing to another level mm. and offered himself up as a Big Mac combo. Oh, nigga, you gay. So now he's walking into the arena to collect his ass whooping. And right. just look at this man's face. Not a thought behind those damn eyes. Oh, nah. Y'all just gotta be... I don't know why Retro thought he was him. I feel like everybody in Baki was tripping, bro. Like, they was low key, like, tripping. I was like, yo, what is y'all problem, chat? Problem, chat. Yeah, I got dementia. Five minutes ago, he turned a Siberian tiger into a goddamn pretzel with just a hug. And now you want to let some random Chinese nigga with a ponytail box him? Yeah, I got dementia. And that's not just some random Chinese nigga. That's 4,000 years of Chinese kung fu you're looking at. It's 4,000 years of kung fu about to do it against 100 million years of ooga booga. Man, shut your nerdy ass up. Oh, hell nah, bro. You told that man to shut his nerdy eye up. It's crazy. You need to put the calculator down and go get some bitches. God damn. Anyway, so Tarzan huh? wakes up. The show's trying to tell us he sensed the 4,000 years of kung fu training. I think bro just smelled Chinese food walking up. And this man just jumps in like Jackie yeah. Chan. Buddy, you are not the main character. It's my time to shine, face ass. Go for the first. Yeah, buddy tripping. Buddy tripping when he's fighting against Pickle right here. Like, look at him. Just look at the size difference. If I'm trying to fight Pickle, I'm gonna be looking scared. Time Pickle actually takes a fighting stance. This man Retsu's like, for this battle, I will call upon every Jackie Chan or Bruce Lee movie I've seen so far. Sokka took one step, and Pickle just starts running at him, meat swinging everywhere. Slaps him and sends him into the goddamn wall. I knew it. I knew that nigga was trash. I told you, bald ass, this idea was stupid. But Retsu was not done. He's like, hmm, it seems as though sheer strength can't beat him. Like, okay. no shit, nigga, can you wrestle? I think the f not. So Pickle starts skedaddling up again. He really wants a taste of Panda Express. But I'll be how Retsu Then Retsu started feeling a little zesty. But he said, I went my hair back and forth. Dripped him and had his rock. Wait, why you said it like that, bro? It's kind of attractive, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Hard booty hit the ground. And then Roundhouse kicked him in the eyeballs with all his strength. He had this man Pickle crying. But not in pain. This Ooga Booga demon was crying because he was thinking... Retsu's the Lulu though. In his mind, he thinks he's winning. He starts hitting Pickle with all the Dang! Dang! Really the next Dragon Warrior. <laughs> Karate chop, gun punch. I learned that one from Rush Hour 3, bitch. So now he's. Rush Hour 3, nah, bro. Rush Hour 3 is insane. That is a crazy uh, movie. Standing there, I didn't find that good. Like, it's hard to make Six good. clean attacks straight to his head. Wait, I'm goaded. I hope I didn't end the fight early. I like it, could you? Man, I Damn, he smacked his head. 
Nah, after that, he gonna have trouble counting for the rest of his life. I'm thinking about buying this book on counting. Three, four. <gasps> What's gonna happen next? Anyway, oh, so no. Retsu's on his knees, hey, pause. Yo. yo, why is his mouth open like that? Double hey, pause. Yo. So Pickle picks this nigga up like an action figure and he's like, Is this a W eats? So I just takes a straight up bite out of him. Damn! Retsu tries to Even he said I'm loving it. Loves to play hard to eat. To be honest, I don't know why this man is so surprised. Come he literally happen. volunteered to be eaten. Now he's astonished. This nigga started munching. So then this man is like, all right, it's time for my rock lead. We took a bite out of pickle. Starts taking off his right goddamn shoes. And General Stride is like, oh shit, he's finally getting serious. But this man, Pickle, could not care less. You bastard. How dare you eat to the son of a warrior? With the sun! Dang! I know for a fact he's regretting all that day. Right like, look at how he was acting the day before. All I can think about is fighting him. Did you see what he did to that news reporter? His dick was like 16 inches, nigga. I just, I just, I just want to wrestle it. The next day. This, this can't be. 4,000 years of kung fu. This can't be by a dinosaur booty clapper. Now nah, I'm not taking. Bro's wild and bro's wild and what the hell? Why the hell are we talking about dinosaur booty clappers? What the hell? Warrior shall not get taken out by a nigga who has never wiped his ass before. So Buddy starts genuinely tweaking. He's like, fuck that bald headed ass nigga who told me Kofu was gonna get me home. I ain't gonna lie, I feel him though. That man Tarzan has been here for three days. He already got some cheeks. So he gives up on all the Jackie Chan movies and joins Pickle in his low IQ fighting. Master Yu Gui. Po. Shifu. Shifu. I'm sorry. Pause. You see, this is a move we like to call the p bitch shuffle. Niggas who use this technique in no way. typically have no bitches, no bread in their pockets, and have zero uh, hands. Uh, uh, to kind of no way. all you have to do is kick him in the balls. Or, better yet, if you really want to crush his soul, just nah, stand crazy. there and eat it. He probably punches like a little bitch. Anyway, so pick up about to end the fight. Yes. But the Bruce Lee in his blood just wouldn't allow him to fight like a goober. He starts we, dodging all of Pickle's attacks, even managed to kick him in the face. And that's when the brain damage from earlier kicked in. This man spawned in an imaginary friend. Man, you suck at fighting. That CT was messing that man Rex to up. Who are you? Can't you tell? I'm Bruce Lee, nigga. She ain't no goddamn Bruce Lee. You look just like me. Exactly, dumbass. The reason you can't abandon your kung fu is because you are kung fu. I ain't gonna lie, you still about to get cooked, but hey, give me a hug before I go. Now go beat that naked nigga's ass. <laughs> So why you sell all that? Richie <laughs> starts giving people the business. Made sure his next shorty won't be having any ooga booga kids running around. Hell no, he touched that man balls. Rexu is gay. He's gay. He's gay. Kick them in their face. But now that attack alone would be too boring. So he uses his musty ass toes to grab onto his hair and knead his ass to sleep. <laughs> All that shit was <laughs> nothing to pickle. This nigga is the embodiment. If I would add this video, every time Ruxu punching is going, what's up? Ah, 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 ah. I might so make putting all your skill points into strength. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie, that nigga's done for. Like this man is on all fours, hey, booty yo. stretched to the sky. I know he feels that breeze hitting his cheek, but he don't care. Ah. What movie am I gonna use next? Fist of Fury? I ain't gonna lie. If I was fighting a nigga and he just gets on all fours to the point, I can see his booty indent from the front. I am calling it a day, bro. I'm going home. Oh, nah. His indent is crazy. Fist of Fury ain't gonna cut it. This motherfucker ain't fighting no more, bro. He doing some other shit. He's about to charge my ass like a lion. I ain't gonna lie. I ain't going out like no bitch. So Pickle just launches at him, mouth wide open. He not trying to wait a second long before having his dessert. Retro trying to defend himself, though. He throws this weak ass punch. But he just gets absolutely fooled. He spared at me. This nigga about to go see Ponytail Jesus. Dang! The announcer is trying to say this was a battle between the immovable shield versus an irresistible spear. Nigga, that shield looking very movable. Look at how bro is slumped on the floor. <laughs> Buddy looked like a cockroach that just got sprayed in rage. Anyway, so Pickle starts crying like, Oh God, Georgia, Georgia, Georgia. Wait, Pickle, them up. don't eat him. Jackie Chan's gonna be in Kung Fu Panda 4 and he wants to watch if you don't it. Get that door, get out of my face. And he just goes straight to munch it. I hope Phantom doesn't tax my food. No, Phantom, what are you doing? Man, he crippled my dog, Retsu so bad he gave up kung fu <laughs> and went in funny. a whole ass boxing arc i'm gonna make a video on that in the second channel link in the description all right wooligans anyway that name was hard right that's like that's not, that's what we're gonna call this house the wooligans anyways let's not even waste no time bro we're gonna start with the nigga who got his ass beat the wars baki's version of vegeta eminem <laughs> if he took steroids this man broke in just to get his ass beat mr firm booty over here was like get your ass up and pickle a blind why are you looking at cheeks like that ulu wulu like man chicks ula wulu hold up hold up hold up hold up ula wulu let me let me find out you want some of that jack comma booty you're zesty my guy 
right? You're just Oh, wait, hold on. What the f nigga? Didn't this man just okay. have a shirt off? Man, whatever, bro. It's not Bach if you don't get a scene of a nigga getting half naked before the fight. So now these two are just staring at each other. The sexual tension is going through the roofs. Like, just look at this nigga pickle, bro. He looks like he's about to ask me if he prayed today. Anyway, so of course this roid head Jack puts zero thought into attacking. Right? Just charges the pickle and hits him with a gumma gumma no buff nigga punch. And he had this man pickle shook. All the dumbass niggas before him trying to use useless techniques. One motherfucker even managed to pack himself up trying to use his hand. Oh, he skipped that man. But he turned his head into baloney and pickle had to get on his knees. The prayer to Jesus for this man's IQ to increase. Anyway, so Jack's like, damn, nigga, you natty? You gotta be a gen or some shit, because ain't no fucking way. Greg Doucette gotta be cooking up a Natty or not. Nah. Then Jack decides to join in on the glazing, and it's like, and that punch didn't chip a single tooth? Nah. <laughs> <laughs> Let's have a bite just, but, Okay. I'm coconuts in my free time. Like, bro, what? That's gonna be the most pause shit I've ever heard in Baki. But then you just look at this man pickle, and he looks excited as fuck. The narrator was trying to say they're drawn together by primal instinct. Nah, bro, they're just zesty. Yo, uh, I'm still good to fight tomorrow. You wanna fight pickle tomorrow? Uh... <laughs> You might want to train your booty. I think Pickle likes nah. foods now. Like, that is not nah. <laughs> might want to train your booty. I think Pickles likes... No. Like that is there not you go. lighting, bro. Anyways, so Jack starts getting overpowered. This dude Pickle starts whipping the C bum built ass nigga around like it was a Twizzler. And he just slings. What is a Twizzler? Now bro's just sitting there like he's in timeout. And hold on, wait, 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 wait. What is Pickle chewing on? His mouth. Hey. Oh my dear God. Hey, his mouth. He's munching hey. on this man's face. This is teeth are still good. I ain't gonna lie. Bro, real real. Like Jack, his teeth are white as fuck. Anyway, so as Pickle's coming back for another kiss, Jack hits him with a sky up a good. Pickle hitting the T pose mid air, but Jack wasn't happy. He was like, What the fuck? I put every ounce of HRT, tread, Viagra into that punch. I couldn't even send a jiggle through his brain. What? How did that punch not knock Pickle out? It's simple. That nigga is trash. Now Pickle's back <laughs> in the booty up position, ready to. That nigga is trash. He's not him. He's absolutely. Ass. He's dog buns. He's booty cheeks. He's like when you walk to the street and you find your grandma and she's homeless there and you realize she bought you some nasty ass mint candy. You eat it? That candy's ass. And just like Jack. Run back his broken ultimate, the Ooga Booga tackle. And it's not a Jack. Look like Bro's not Goku. I'm thinking about it. Baki and Retsu run in just in time to witness Pickle jump at Jack. <laughs> But once the holy lights disappear, this nigga parried Pickle completely. He had everyone surprised. They all thought Jack was sorry as shit. Anyway, Slim Shady's not finished. He palms Baki's head and just shoves okay. him to the ground like a baby. Bro called Jack's Baki. <laughs> Yo, that chat list sorry he as called shit. him Baki. Anyway, Slim Shady's not finished. He palms Baki's head and... <laughs> Pickle Baki. <laughs> just shoves it into the ground like a filthy high school bully. Then he brings him close like he's about to go in for another kiss, but instead he just eats him back into the yeah. arena. Motherfucker jumped down, started trauma dumping on the caveman who can't even speak English. Do you see what I turned myself into? I ate trend bologna sandwiches every day. Got no bitches to keep my test levels at their maximum. Trained till I was peeing the bed every goddamn night. Took every drug known to mankind. Bro, I even had leg stretching surgery. And now I'm mad because my balls fell off. Then this man just Mike Tyson Pickle's ear off and spits right? it back at him. And at that very moment, Jack should have known. You fucked up. This motherfucker picture just starts trolling Jack. He would vanish like Houdini, then appear again. Whole time, he was just bouncing up the walls at Mach 10 speeds. And Jack's just standing there thinking, Man, I'm cooked. I just realized this nigga used to literally beat dinosaurs up for fun. God, I ain't never asked you for shit before in my life. But please, help me beat this. Oh, you didn't. This man pickle had Jack stunned. Damn! Damn! It's just combo, bro. As the body ragdolling midair. That man spinning! His goddamn Dang. skull. It started emo to that man an x-ray. This is not Mortal Kombat. His ass. Anyway, so Bruh. now it's time for Pickle's victory meal. He tried to taste some of that Canadian poutine. But as he starts walking towards Jack to take a bite, Pickle shits himself. Oh, no. Nah, nah, watch out. No. Jack, I, Jack. Oh. <laughs> it turns out when he was a wee little Ooga Booga jit, Pickle was boxing a wasp. And when his dumb ass killed and ate it, it stung his ass. This bitch dramatic as f. There's no way it hurt that bad, though. Anyway, so because of that, he's got a fear of things that attack even after being killed. So he just sat in the corner crying like a little bitch. What a little pussy. Jack's literally knocked out. Unk! <laughs> 
is not Jack. He's a fucking demon. This motherfucker programmed his body to give any nigga who managed to knock him out the most diabolical fuck you ever. Anyway, so fast forward a bit. They try to bring this nigga back from the gulag. And I kid you not, the second the doctor left, Dr. Riz, the nigga who looked like Eminem, he's gone. Ah, uh, don't worry. Dr. Riz is crazy. We'll see him soon. This motherfucker returned to resume the fade. My apologies, Mr. Pickle. I left before I could introduce you to my butt, you bitch ass bitch. And then Jack just starts straight pommeling Pickle. In reality, those kicks ain't even doing shit to this man, but to Pickle, this man arose again like Jesus Christ. He wants zero smoke. They take the fight outside. All the NPCs just trying to enjoy their Sunday music, And Pickle bro. stops all of a sudden and is like, what, what? I like that. So this nigga turns around, runs up to Jack, uppercuts him. And Buddy looking at the sky like, wow, what a beautiful day. Looks down just in time to catch a left hook from hell. I said I meant spinning. Spinning so fast, that thing was gonna fly off. I said I meant to a Beyblade. Nah, GG, bro. Someone grab his reboot card. Anyway, so he wakes up again in the hospital, and the old heads are begging him, like, Nigga, please pack it up. You can't handle him. But bro is running on pure delusion, about to go run it back again. Please, bro, just go back to your room. Your ass, bro! Huh? You can't squabble! After Pickle knocked your ass <laughs> out, he personally carried you to the squabble hospital because he word. thought you were a weak little bitch. You weren't even an optum at that point. You are just a meal. And this man Jack just starts crying. 